Wake up every day on the block. Wake up. Wake up. There's seven solo. In house music. Square Biz Records. What's good? Ah, Square Biz Records. Started a long time ago. Started long, about 20 years ago. Maybe even a little bit longer. Uh, wanting to have the recording experience and without a, a lot of the BS that was happening in the industry at the time. So I uh, put together a record company uh, working with uh, DJ Los and Shooter Specialist and I uh, just did all of the footwork as far as the, the paper, the, the business, what it take to make your craft uh, professional. Trial and error, trial and error, but Square Biz Records uh, was a dream and is not a dream anymore, it's uh, a reality. We put together people from all across the world and that doesn't happen all the time with your record company and uh, we're glad that we're able to have outreach to the global economy as far as, uh, you know, your entertainment experience. Yeah, what up, what up, people? It's your boy with the Weez, the Swanky Man. Yeah, yeah. King out right here with Switch Tunes, you know, aka Kakachi. Yo, man, the rap is Square Bees. Square Bees, rap is Square Bees. Oh, yeah, Lagos, Nigeria, Hustle. So, we are here and we're about to talk how we met Seven, seven Solo. So I guess we the Weez can tell you. Yeah, all this was back then, 2014. Yeah, we're just hustling in the studio, trying to create something different and we recorded the song, that was an Eminem's beat, I'm not afraid. And I titled it being behind the mic. Yeah. And this is the man behind the mix. Yeah, I did that. Yeah, I and uploaded that. that online and all of a sudden seven solo saw that online message me online like wow. This shit sound crazy, where you are? I told him Nigeria. Yeah, really had it. He didn't believe that man. He didn't believe that. So we all linked up and everything went well. We sent paperwork and we worked on the ground. Man, man. I just called G Money. G -money. Listen to G Money. That's yeah. what I keep playing in the background. We you know. money went well. G -money. So everything was okay. Then along the way, we put G Money on iTunes, Spotify, Amazon, Desires, all everywhere. Our platform, G Money was a success. Wow. Yeah, and since then we've been rapping Square Bees. Yeah. Yeah, I, I met Switch and, uh, and, and Mike uh, through Reverb Nation. That's a, one of those apps that help you with your music, get it out there, get you exposure to uh, industry type things. Uh, so, reached out to them through Reverb Nation and uh, we had some emails back and forth and uh, we went on and put together a record and uh, had a lot of conversations with his parents uh, because I, I wasn't quite certain on what I was allowed to to discuss with him because from where he lives, there's a lot of turmoil that happens over there. Uh, so you just want to be careful, make sure you're not bringing up a, a political issue or something that would cause trouble for him or for his family over there. We were able to, to bond that way, uh, emails and he does call me. Uh, quite frequent and his parents will call me to uh, you know, to talk with me to just ask me general life questions so uh, they've become like my family over there and I'm certain that I'm family to Mike and Switch over here uh, I have faith that those guys will be even more in 2019 than they have been and I look forward to definitely seeing them with that passport you heard me? Wake up. Wake up. Stop. Minus 25 that's gonna be the, the number one charter uh, coming from out of Lagos, Nigeria. My man Switch produced that. Uh, him and my guy, Michael Witty, uh, Witty Rose. Those my guys over there in Nigeria. Uh, they sent me the track, sent me the track, said, uh, ask, say, uh, they said, Seven, Seven, can you uh, do trap music? So, uh, I said, yeah, send it on over here to me and uh, let me see what I can do with it. Uh, the track was so dynamic that uh only took about 15 minutes, 20 minutes to write the whole song. It almost came right off the pen, just, uh, you know, just fluent. Switch. You don't know, yeah. I don't really know what pushed me in making this beat, though, yeah. but That's I had to do it. 
because I was like, ah, first time in history, I got to work with an American artist. So I got to do something like, that's going to fit a little bit into Nigerian, but more of the American stuff. So I did that cool and came out so far and thank God for everything. But that's not all. We still did a new one called Minus Minus Twenty Five Live on that way. You know, spread the news live on TV. And we we really having this yeah. dream of like going over there, yeah. being with Seven Solo, doing it for yeah, real this yeah. time. Think no about jokes, the industry, man. Because we are out there and we are out here, and we're gonna take over anytime soon. Yeah, so that's what it is. Shout out to Seven Solo. Solo. Shout out to Square Beast. Please. Shout out to my homie Willie Wiz. And I'm still gonna say shout out to myself. Switch, yeah. aka I never Kakashi. Forget. Sent it back over there to them, and they loved it. You know, so uh, they're looking for the worldwide thing that they hit a little bit bigger this time. This is the third record we would have put out, and uh, they're very happy about it. They're looking forward to the video. And uh, Manage 25 just was my attempt at some trap music. You know, I'm old head, boom bap, that type. But you gotta try it all. And uh, I enjoyed it, I enjoyed it. So you'll be seeing more of that from me. We got a couple of things uh, lined up here uh, with the Seven Global. Uh, the website should be coming up here in, his, in, in January 2019. Uh, the clothing line. Sporty Shorty and Sugar Shorty, we looking at having a, uh, in the springtime, having a, a a fashion show. So look forward to that, uh, maybe March or, or April of 2019. Uh, In-house music is always looking to bring a new sound to anybody that's looking for it. Come on through, work with us. And uh, the next song that's coming out, uh, <laughs> No Sweat. You gonna be ready for that one right there, Brad. I'm telling you, I had to hit the D.O. twice for this one. I'm going in on it, no sweat, no sweat. So that's the future coming up for Seven Global and Square Biz Records. And uh, stay tuned, stay tuned. Yep. Graduated with honors from the block. Went to class every day. There you go.